In this video, we're going to take a look at an individual limit. We're going to have the limit as x approaches pi over 2 of cosine x minus 1 over sine x. All right, now with any limit problem, the very first step that you should always do is a direct substitution because if you are successful at doing a direct substitution and coming up with a numerical value, then that's the way we want to go. So we are going to look here at a direct substitution. So I'm going to take my pi over 2 and plug it in. So I will have cosine of a pi over 2 minus 1 all over a sine pi over 2. Okay, now, um, hopefully you've got your unit circle memorized. If not, you can think about that unit circle. Pi over 2 is right here, and the ordered pair there is a 0, 1. All right, and we know at the ordered pair on our unit circle, um, the first value is our cosine value, and the second one is our sine value. So that lets you evaluate this pretty easy here. Cosine of pi over 2 is going to be 0, minus 1 on that top sine of pi over 2 is going to be the 1. So I'm going to have a negative 1 over 1, which is going to give me a negative 1. So a pretty simple um, limit, even though it looks maybe a little challenging with those trig functions in there. If you do that direct substitution right away and you are familiar with your unit circle and finding those trig values, you should be good to go. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.